The head of the Democratic National Party is backing off after controversial comments that she made about Governor Scott Walker. Scott Walker has given women the back of his hand. Mm -hmm. And there is no, I, I know that is stark, I know that is uh, direct, but that is reality. All right, that's the comment that Debbie Wasserman Schultz made when she was in Milwaukee yesterday that caused all the fires. Now, I'm telling you, women's group, the governor, has set women back in Wisconsin. Reaction is still spinning today. And 12 News political reporter Kent Wayne Scott has the governor and his opponent as the race heats up. Do you, do you want to go? So, would this be like uh, for a road construction? Governor Scott Walker's campaign stop at a Fond du Lac welding company was suddenly in the national spotlight after DNC chair Debbie Wasserman Schultz targeted the governor with some. Some harsh comments Wednesday in Milwaukee. What Republican Tea Party extremists like Scott Walker are doing is they're grabbing us by the hair and pulling us back. Mm -hmm. And it's unacceptable. Governor, what's your reaction to Chairwoman Wasserman Schultz's comments Wednesday in Milwaukee? Well, I just think it's, it's outrageous and it's really unfortunate. While many Wisconsin sure Republicans were quick to blast Wasserman Schultz, calling her language insensitive to victims of domestic violence, this was our first chance to hear what the governor had to say about the comments aimed at him and his policies. To use that kind of language, uh, just completely inappropriate. Um, and I would hope uh, that my opponent and others would, as loudly as possible, denounce that. Shouldn't matter where it comes from, regardless of party. Uh, people shouldn't be using that language. Walker said that if Mary Burke believes the comments from the Democratic Party leader were, in his words, outrageous, she should take a strong stand against them. It's not the language I would use. At a campaign event in Wausau, Burke said she agrees Governor Walker's policies have hurt women, but considers the chairwoman's wording inappropriate. As I said, it's not the language I would use, and I don't think it's appropriate. Now, as we told you off the top, by early afternoon, the DNC chairwoman, Debbie Wasserman Schultz, had stepped back her comments but did not apologize for them. She issued a statement saying that she should not have used the words she used but still criticized Governor Walker for policies she says have been bad for Wisconsin women. All right.